Like and subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon to get new video updates. Lindemann allegations, time for Ramstein to take a stand DW02.06.2023 for several days, new attention has been paid to the concept of the row zero at concerts, a special restricted area between the stage and the audience, where selected fans can follow the concert and party with the stars before or after the show. In general, is the Zero series is designed to accommodate both men and women, and getting up close and personal with your favorite band is every fan a stream. Throughout popular music history, women who had one-night stands with rock stars were called groupies, a term that is now outdated. But of course there are still women who enjoy being intimate with celebrities, and that is not a problem if it remains a consensual act, and everyone is left unscathed. But at the experiences that always more women are sharing some of them terribly untrue under oath about their encounters with Ramstein s frontman to Lindemann, taboo breaks Don T belong backstage. Ramstein have been provocative since their inception, breaking taboos are her trademark. In their works, Ramstein led by Lindemann portray themselves as ultra-villains, but it was always assumed that they were actually really nice people. In one of his poems, Lindemann fantasizes about sex in sleeping or unconscious women. Aside from posting photos of their tour and concerts on Instagram as usual, the band only posted a tweet on May 28 in response to the allegations. Given the allegations circulating about Vilnius on the internet, we can rule out the possibility that what is claimed took place in our environment they explained. We are not aware of any official investigation into this matter. For many fans this is not enough, and they wonder if they can still like the band. Some of them are already trying to get rid of their tickets for the current tour. The Fall of an Idol Since I am a Ramstein fan myself, I also wish that the band would take a clear stance against any form of violence not just against young women. We need to hear, 